Divine Word missionaries recognize that Papua New Guinea is a nation in transition. The church here is also in transition. It is alive in Christ, yet in need of material support and prayer. Awareness is growing that we are the church and that we have a role to play. Divine Word missionaries arrived in Papua New Guinea in 1896. From 1948 through 2002, American Divine Word missionaries Bishop Leo Arkfeld, the famous Flying Bishop, and Bishop Raymond Callis made significant contributions to the East Sepik province, establishing many schools and medical aid posts. There were many struggles as our missionaries reached and evangelized the people through the years. The country with a population of almost 7 million people has over 800 languages. One challenge was to decide which language to use for the country, the church, and school work. On April 25, 2015, Joseph Rizinski SVD was ordained the Bishop of the Diocese of Wewak. The diocese did not have leadership for a few years. Added to this is the fact that government services totally deteriorated or collapsed in East Sepik province and in Papua New Guinea as well. Bishop Rizinski's main objectives are to establish a viable education system through our Catholic schools, to provide medical care through our Catholic health services, and to improve the water supply for the people. There is great need for trained personnel whom we hope to educate in our pastoral centers, teachers' college, and vocational schools. It is through the grace of God, the generosity of good people, and the dedication of local priests, teachers, nurses, and lay leaders that we bring about change in a tangible way. We could not meet the daily challenges in all that we do here in the Diocese of Wewak without the prayerful support of our friends and co-missionaries near and far and you today.